The following question reads that how many of the following compounds produce a carboxylic acid on heating and a reflux with an excess of what acidified K2Cr207? So you're basically doing oxidation. So here's your oxidizing agent. Now the first option, this first option is, is an aldehyde. So here's the first reaction. Remember aldehydes, they get oxidized to carboxylic acid when you heat it with K2Cr207. So this carbon... The, it was forming an aldehyde first, now it's forming a carboxylic acid, it has changed into a carboxylic acid. So this is the first uh, uh, compound and it's going to get oxidized into a carboxylic acid. So, so we just wanted to figure out whether it's changing into a carboxylic acid or not. So the first one is definitely changing into a carboxylic acid. The second one is a ketone, CSTCOCH3, CO is in the middle. So here's the structure, CO is in the middle. So CHT, C double bond O and CHT, it's a ketone. Ketones don't undergo any oxidation. So this uh, is not going to get oxidized by K2Cr207. They're resistant to oxidation. Uh, the third one is a primary alcohol. If you look at the molecule carefully, let's draw this molecule. So this is the molecule that I've drawn. If you look carefully, the OH uh, that is attached to the carbon atom, it's a primary alcohol because it's only bonded on one side with a carbon chain. On the other two sides, they are hydrogen. So this is a primary alcohol. Primary alcohols get oxidized into aldehydes and they further get oxidized to carboxylic acids. So here you can see the flowchart uh, primary alcohol getting oxidized to an aldehyde and it's further oxidized into a carboxylic acid. So this is also correct. It's, a, it's the correct option. It's going to get oxidized to an aldehyde. Now if you look at the fourth option, this one is a secondary alcohol. Let me draw this molecule first. So I've drawn this molecule over here and you'll notice that uh, there's CHT, CHT on both sides and then there's a CHOH in the middle. So that means if you focus on this carbon atom, the alpha carbon atom, it's uh, bonded on two sides with a carbon chain. So it's a secondary alcohol. Uh, secondary alcohols, they get further oxidized into ketones. Secondary alcohols always get oxidized. The OH changes into a ketone group. So this is the product that you're going to get. It's not going to be a carboxylic acid. So this option is also incorrect. So the only two correct, the only two correct options that are going to change into carboxylic acids, the first one and the third molecule drawn over here. So only two uh, molecules are going to get, uh, uh, they're going to be converted into carboxylic acids. So option B is going to be your correct option for this question.